Hello there everybody, I'm Maslan, and welcome to my YouTube channel, or well, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today we're doing, continuing on with our Baldur's Gate playthrough. And today we have quite a few things we're gonna do. We, I think we're gonna respec Astorian yet again, and Coralak, and also give Coralak uh, heal giant strength potions for now because we have quite a bit of them and quite a bit of gold as well so yeah let's get into it and also let's check uh, up with her <sighs> I'm coming along just not fast enough any word on my people I've killed the Dwaygard that were hunting you. I'm almost sorry to hear it. I hope to have the pleasure myself. Oh. <laughs> There's plenty more guarding my people, but I'd say you've made a fine start. Uh, okay. So yeah, let's go back to camp. Because now that the Storian has that uh, Hill Giant Strength Club, there really is no need for him to have any strength, like at all. On my way. We are gonna have to find Withers. There he is. Fate, dost thou require a new as? I've respect Astorian so many times, and now oh, we didn't have <laughs> too much strength to dump, but I mean it's better just do it like this. That looks fine. Hey, yeah, let's go and do Carlek well, like now as well. Only problem now is that. It's I'm gonna take quite a few of uh, Hill Giant Strength Potions, but I think it will be worth it in the end. We are gonna absolutely dump the strength and increase the constitution and dexterity. Which one do I want the highest is the question. I think we do it like this. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that looks good. And I guess we could put in some more into intelligence just to get it up from zero. Or like not to have minus on it. And... Since there isn't a way to increase the wisdom, it could be a good thing to increase it, I think. Now we level them up. Uh, spells. We want leap and hunt. No, we want hunter's mark and speak with animals and archer. And now, as another spell, we take a leap. And still a Gloomstalker. New feat is gonna be Sharpshooter. Spell is gonna be that's without trace, I think. It's gonna be the best one. Uh, Berserker. 
feet. Uh, tavern brawler. And we're going to increase our constitution. And yeah, this should make it so that our armor class is higher. Yeah, now Astorian is the only weak one. Or like, with weak armor class. But, Farlek is gonna have to keep on chugging uh, these ones. Still alive, so that's progress. So now, I think before we do the Grim Forge, we should go and do the Crash. I think that would be the wisest thing, because we're pretty much done here in the Underdark. We also need to kill Aunt the Affle. Or at least bring her low and let her escape. Mm, so we should go to... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? No, it's... Is it the riverside? I don't think so, right? Oh, oh yeah. Uh, it should be... Is there... No. What the fuck is that one called then? Oh, I haven't unlocked it yet. Oh, balls. Oh well. Swift as my feet can carry me. So, Laysel is not gonna like the fact that we are going here without her. But she is just gonna have to deal with it. I really wish that I had the Titan String Bow on the story though. It would be major puggers. What are you doing? Hold up before they see you, Magresham. You're the Magresham for talking that tone with me. Spare me. There's bigger problems right now than my manners. Look. That lot are swarming all over the bridge. I don't know what they want, but it can't be good. I'm going to find another way around. You ought to do the same. Unless you're looking for a fight, that is. Seems like you have good survival instincts. Maybe you should join me instead. What? Just follow you around? I go my own way. Alone. Okay. Who are you? Nobody. Just another harassing fool trying to stay alive. There's plenty of us around. <laughs> okay. Rag. That's it. I'm getting out of here. I'm not gonna lie though, I'm still kind of pissed that uh Drop your weapons! I'll feed your innards to the ants before I do that. The Halsin fight is still bugged. Your last chance! No, look up. That was your last chance, Istic. Now burn! Wasting time, Beretta. You're not here to play with the locals. Of course, Kithrak. We merely sought to. No excuses. Question, kill, then move on. Find the weapon. Our queen watches us. Fail her at your peril. <sighs> Can we kill them? Please. Pretty please. Yeah. We are pro most likely going to have to do that, actually. They are kind of the worst, not going to lie. What easy prey you make, walking right within my blade's embrace. These creatures are so simple to ensnare, Beretha. You mule too much about your task. Forgiveness, Kithrak. And as for you, tell me. 
Why shouldn't I run you through this instant? I don't know you. I pose no threat. Oh, this is... God damn. We should not be able to miss this. So, oh, nice. Of course you are not a threat. You are nothing until I tell you otherwise. For you to keep sucking air, it is necessary for you to tell me something of worth. A vessel fell from the sky. We seek a precious weapon that was taken from it. You feel Shadowheart's anxiety. The weapon that Voss seeks is the same one the Absolute's followers are hunting. It's the artifact that she carries. Her mind focuses. The Gith's suspicion cannot be aroused. They cannot discover that the weapon they seek is right within their grasp. Help us find it and I will leave your blood beneath your skin unspilled. Don't help them. Don't tell them a thing. We're dead if you do. Very, very sneaky, Shadowheart. You need to start from the beginning. What is this weapon you're after? Do not speak. Your bleating offends my ears. Just stand still. He begins to move his hand in a quick flurry of gestures. Come on, Arcane check. Heck yeah, dude. You realize he's casting detect thoughts. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Nothing even approaching a useful thought in that skull. I ought to just kill you. Read his thoughts. I'm interested. Please don't fail this. Oh, that's the one. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna re-roll it. A worthless kill, no sport. If this one was even slightly useful, I might spare her. You know what? Just do the persuasion. You ought to just leave. You have no right to decide my fate. Fate. Should be enough. Yeah, it is. My blade is my right. If I can take your life, it is mine. But perhaps you have other uses. Very well, Istik. Seek out survivors from the ship that crashed on this wretched world. Bring me their heads. Bring me the weapon. If you succeed, the reward will be great. Now go. Quite a bit of experience. Heck yeah, dude. Oh no. Didn't sort my inventory. But yeah, we push on. This leads up to here. Ooh, and a chest. Wait, what? How did I get the tech? Oh, wait. Yeah, right. <laughs> I forgot that I casted it. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. You know, but I'm gonna go and try and do kata. Oh, you know what? Actually. Oh, I wanted this to be the crash episode, but I could go and <sighs> try and do this again. Try and complete that one. Then go to Aunt Ethel. 
Because I don't know if she moves if I were to progress. But yeah, let's begin with uh, forging the weapon. Curse to put my hands on everything. And I'm most likely just gonna do it for like the experience, because I will most likely not ever use the weapon. We're gonna have to do... Where do we have the bark? Or... There it is. Oh. That's how you do it. For a great sword, dagger, or sickle. Well, that's the question now, isn't it? I think the dagger is gonna be the move. Do I even have a dagger? I guess this is a dagger. Let's go and see if there's a dagger here. Surely there is, right? One eternity later. Ooh, I found the dagger. It also looks like I might be able to return to Helsin now. Because it says return to Helsin. Let's see if I can actually complete this quest now. It would be pretty good. Not gonna lie. Nature's blessings. Are you ready to do what is necessary? Yes, finally it's unbugged. Oh heck yeah, dude. All the leaders are dead. The grove is safe. You did it. You actually did it. The leader's dead. <laughs> Praise Sylvanus. No, that's not right. Praise you, my friend. The grove owes you a debt beyond measure. Killing's never my first choice. But those three were too dangerous to leave alive. Uh, I've done my part. Now tell me about Moonrise. Let's get out of this pit, firstly. Return to the grove. I'll make my own way there. I can see to some matters there, and we can discuss what comes next amidst more bucolic surroundings than here. Oh, heck yeah, dude. Now... Uh, hmm. Oh, right. First of all, first things first. Lighted village. Let's go and craft the dagger. And. Hmm. I think that maybe we should do. The hag next. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, right. The roaring furnace awaits an offering. A candy sweet scent wafts forth. The Sousa bark infuses the weapon from within the flames. The flames sputter away. The dagger is yours for the taking. Hell yeah, my dude. And now it's a regular forge. And I think it's magic, Bane. No, oh right, it silences on hit. That's what, that is what it does. Uh, two, seven to twelve. Uh, eight to eleven. Yeah, I think I'll go with this one. I doubt that I will ever use it. 
Uh, hey, I have it now. <laughs> okay. Not. Yeah. No. Actually, let's go to go to the grove first. And then we can do Ethel. Or know what? Actually, I'm gonna postpone this, that Ethel fight because, to be honest with you, I haven't figured out which stat to raise. But it might be Wisdom. A scout just reported. The goblin's leadership has been decimated. We might escape this place yet. And I hear you are the one to thank. I'm grateful. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. You can keep your coin. Very good of you. Thank you. It's quite a day for reunions. Halcyn has returned, too. And I expect he'll want to speak with you. As for us, no armies at our heels. Amazing. We can finally leave. But perhaps we need not speak of farewells. We'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. Uh, I'll see you there. Now let's talk to Helsen. With the leadership dead, no attack will be mounted on the grove. I am in your debt, my friend. Speak to Wrath. He will reward you for your efforts. The freaking grass, dude. Aga is dead. She was swayed by the shadow druids. I had no choice. Korga. Poor child. The grove will be a dimmer place without her potential. But you are right. You had no choice. I failed her long before you arrived. The shadows could not have tempted her if I had taught her as I should have. But the grove still stands even if she does not. Thanks to you. Uh, what about my problem? I need to get to Moonrise Towers. Soon. First, I must set matters to rights in the grove. And you should celebrate your victory. He is like down bad. After being dormant for so long, your God infection damn. is unlikely to produce new symptoms spontaneously. Tomorrow morning, we shall discuss what is to come. What happens next? The journey to Moonrise Towers and all the dangers that that entails. But that's tomorrow's problem. Take some time for yourself tonight. Rest, celebrate. Come morning, I'll be by your side. Okay, then let's go down to uh, and grab our reward. And also, I would kind of like to get another reset for like a long rest. Before we attack on the Ethel. Because then we can get uh, three m new more uh, Hill Giant Strength ones. I have something to ask. I wasn't sure about you at first. Thought you might be trouble. I was very wrong. You've done it. You brought Halcyn back. Thank you. No, thanks is not enough. May Sylvanus bless you for all your days. I cannot imagine taking on a camp full of goblins was a simple task. Think nothing of it. Uh, I'm glad Halcyn is As safe. Am I. The grove will be whole again. Let me show you on your map where you can find the cache. Take this rune. You'll need it. Place it among the pedestals inside our library. 
When the wolf glows brightest, everything in the vault below will be yours. Oh, she. remember I don't think there's too much good stuff here a beautiful glaive so why does touching it give me a knot in my stomach but I think Arlek could use this now it looks not good but we could just make her look like that Still kind of the same deal, you know. And that's everything. So, I think that's pretty much all we can do here. If we don't want to progress Underdark more or go to the Yankee crash. Uh, let's go to the crash. A little detour, but hopefully Aunt Ethel won't move. We should be fine. We should be fine. Right? <laughs> right? I think we're fine. I think I did the crash before I did Aunt Ethel on my original play playthrough, so we should be fine, I think. Better be cautious. Oh, I don't like that though, that it says that it's gonna progress, so make sure to tie up loose ends. Don't like that, but let's do it anyways. Yes. It should say if some of the quests I have have uh, uh, updated yet. And I think we're fine. Let that all fill my pack. Let's go and have a little bit of an explore. What the hell did I just loot? Oh, a rotting basket. I'm sure that will come in useful. Ooh, we could actually teleport back here, so we could just teleport back and forth. I'm gonna do that real quick and see if something has changed. Alright, alright, alright. Let's keep on exploring the crash then. Have to keep going. Now there is uh, quite a lot of stuff to do here actually. And I don't think that I will be able to fit it all into... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. don't think I will... have enough time to fit it all into this uh, uh, video. Oh, 
Come on, dude. Okay, Astorian, you will shoot the go ghouls before they're able to do anything. Hopefully, you won't miss. Now, knowing Historian, the likelihood of him missing is pretty good. You one shot him. Greg did. Oh, but then he missed. Okay. Okay, so Karlak is also in on this turn. I think yeah, I have a lots of rages left. Let's throw something. That's it. Try and get rid of this little shit. Okay then. So, yeah, I could just go and straight up fucking off. I think that's gonna be exactly what I'm gonna do. Think you can take me on? Unfortunately. That undead warding is no joke. But Shadowheart should be able to. Are they resist? No, they're not. Oh. But they are resistant to everything else except for... Okay. And I need to deal... 20. I think the, the Guiding Bolt will be the move here. Or not, because I can't reach them. Holy shit! He became... A lot beefier. Sheesh, dude. Okay. Could I hit him before something tragic happens? Just hoping, yeah. Yes, dash. Now, I don't like that. Not at all. Especially not that everyone is ganging up on me. Not a fan at all. So I have to deal with these guys first. Before I can deal with those. Because that undead warding on him is gonna be a pain in the ass to deal with. Nice. Blood comes easy these days. That's him dealt with for now. Can't really do anything more. Dark, what the? What the hell are you talking about? 
I guess I could just hit you then. Want to do it? Ain't no way, dude. There we go. Okay, that's good. Hmm. Are these? No, they're not. That is really is too bad. Raise him in there. I need to hold on. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, no, wait. Oh, he already has Hunter's Marks on, mark on him. What a shot. And um, okay. I can't even catch my breath. I'm heating up. Now I'm not gonna lie to you. Probably should have uh, definitely Away. Most likely should have uh, uh, what the? Dude, first. Oh, that's not good. And they absolutely annihilated me. That's the problem with monks. They are very hard to hit, but if you hit them, they are pretty much. to that dude. Questions that I will most likely never get the answer to.
There we go. Now, we rest me. Oh, because they killed me? Oh, fuck. Because they straight up killed me, I need to drink another potion. Fuck, dude. Whatever comes, I'm ready. I'm also gonna have to reapply. And then we do a short rest. A brief respite. I think Karlak will be the one to loot everything. Seems like definitely the best choice, being how I'm gonna send everything to her anyways. I should definitely hit level 6 before leaving this area. Yeah, and that, that area goes to the next act. Someone's left a trap out for us. Maybe I need more pockets. So yeah, let's go and talk to this lady. Yes. Too good. Ah, a friendly face. Oh, you are a sweet, sweet blessing, my dear. You know, I've had nothing but trouble all day. I've been accosted, chased, insulted. Look over there. Do you see that wretched little hive? Lethander's Monastery, a site of pilgrimage. How is it wretched? Oh, I mean no offense to the Morning Lord. I simply prefer when his monasteries aren't overrun with brutish, stupid, rude Githyanki. They have the audacity to call that hole a crèche, as if it weren't actually a murderous training camp. <laughs> Honestly, I was doing them a favor offering to buy one of their eggs. And how am I repaid? Attacked and run off like some transient. I wonder why. You tried to buy one of the children? What? No, of course not. I was merely... Well... Uh... Look, it's just an egg. The Society of Brilliance asked me to acquire one of their row so they can incubate it and once it hatches... Raise the spawn in their tradition. The society believes a Githyanki raised in a peaceful, nurturing environment can overcome its violent nature. Hogwash, of course. A Githyanki can no more rise above its nature than gnomes can fly. Well, if we throw the gnomes, they could technically fly for a while. Violence is a thought, not inherited. You don't need to steal a child to know that. You've been sipping from the same goblet as the society. Perhaps you'd be willing to help then, to prove your point. They may have chased me away, but surely the Gith would welcome a person with such sympathetic views to their crash. And once inside, you could simply purloin an egg. You'll be well compensated, of course. Just bring me an egg. Oh. <sighs> um, 
Let's trade with her first. Oh, nice. She has. Oh my god, it is expensive though. It is very good for Karlak. Or probably actually better for me. Oh fuck, I want this. I want this so bad. I also want these ones as well. Ah, but they are so fucking expensive. Oh my god. Well, one of us is gonna have to use this. It's just too good. Oh, that's good. My, my. That's good. Why does she have so much good shit on her? God damn it. I mean, I... I'm just gonna have to buy that. just too good but we are gonna have to use this because it's not looking too good it is very good though to be fair and i think you're gonna have to use this one oh i like this one better sounds good i'm in i see this being a highly prosperous partnership a word of advice. Avoid direct confrontation. Crash-bound Gith Yankee can be a deadly sort. Okay, so now, now I'm up to 19 AC. That is very good. I'm not a fan of how much this Freaking armor cost me though. What a day. Let's see if historian could Move. maybe steal something. Neither seen nor heard. That's gonna pass. I mean, I really want this, so let's, let's pray, let's just pray, pray, pray. And I think actually if I give guidance to him, it will be easier. There's one that she can give. If it's not guidance, is that? Oh, that's just saving for us. Oh, okay. Let's have some fun. Let's try our luck. Come on. There's no talking Bitch. your way out of this. You'll have to defend your actions the old-fashioned way. Well, that's not good. And I'm very close to us as well. Freaking great, dude. That's it. We're going on lethal. God. Oh, she's going to run away. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, no, 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 no. Look at two. It can't just straight up kill her. Oh, 
Okay, I don't like that Astorian failed it, because it ruined my reputation with Karlak. But now that we have uh, knocked her out, we might as well steal from her. Unfortunately, I can't pick up with her. Into the shadows. Oh. Okay. Can't give up now. Well, shit. Let's move. I have a feeling that she's going to move on, and she had a lot of my gold on her as well. That's not good. And I might have failed the quest to bring her the egg. Oh, I most likely did. Let's hope that I did not. I mean, there is a chance that I did not fail it. Although it is kind of slim, to say the least. Maybe not. That was tough. This kind of been used in a while. Fuck, we got our necklace, at least. Now, that is where we're going to end today's video. Thank you so, so much for watching me today. And if you liked it, consider pressing the like button and leaving a comment. If you have any suggestions on items or other stuff like that to be on the lookout for. Or have any tips in general for me. But until then, hej då, ha det så bra!